white papers say the knowledge worker found that only 20, sorry, only 35% of employers trust their employees to work from home. And also high trust organizations are 50% more productive. I mean, it kind of makes, makes sense to me. But Tim, what, what can we say here? How, how, how do we breach that trust? Yeah. I mean, the, the concepts of trust don't change whether you're at home or you're in an office. They're, they're still the same metrics are in place about trust, but a lot of people have equated that trust to proximity. So I can only trust you if I can see you, if I can look over your desk and see if you're doing your work. We just have to take that kind of logic and just kind of move it into where people are working anywhere. And so there still needs to be transparency, transparency in the discussions about what's expected in a, in a working day. And I'm going to use that very lightly because a working day isn't nine to five anymore when you take this on board, but also understanding what is the actual outcome. In the past, particularly in my field in marketing, everyone was focused on output. So focused on those tasks you're doing every day, right? Have you ticked all those boxes? Instead of looking at that bigger picture, the outcome. If we shift all of our thinking to outcomes, it doesn't actually matter where or when you're doing it as long as the outcome is reached. And that sort of transparency, that agreement between the employer or the manager and the employee means that you can move forward together.